Kyle, four wins on the bounce, another home win, a clean sheet, three big points. Yeah, again, massive. Um, wasn't pretty at times, we were just talking about it again. Um, kept a really good shape and did the fundamentals and the basics correct. And um, we created some chances and we took them and um, in the end it was fairly comfortable and it's another win and just a static for all the effort and all the, all the effort the boys are putting in. And um, yeah, four in a row and we'll, we'll try and make it five on Saturday. Definitely. We've come into the game on a positive run of form and with a brilliant away win at Fairham on Saturday. And I know you, sometimes you've asked for a little bit of grit and determination from the lads just to keep going in them difficult situations. As you say tonight, the wind's up. We've had to deal with that and a, and a good Brock and Us team. So you must be you must be chuffed with that. Yeah, look, it's another learning curve. I've, I don't think we've played up here with those wins and, and, and it's really difficult. You, you're not going to have the free-flowing football that, that people want. However, when we're in the right areas, we look really dangerous. Our combination plays and our little one-twos and our link-up and trying to break the lines. We're, we're a different side. Um, and it's really positive because it's a time of season now where we're looking at who's staying and who's going and, and how we're going to shape up for next season. So, so many positives to work on. Delighted that we're four in a row, um, but we're relentless in what we're going to do and we want to go and try and make it five on Saturday. Yeah, and uh, Jack Delves, you've brought in, you know, a few weeks ago. He yeah. scored again tonight. He's not, he's not afraid of levering it from distance, is he? Yeah, he's just got great technique and, and he's a cultured, you know, cultured left foot and, and he's a wonderful young lad and... I have to keep him motivated and, and keep challenging him because, you know, I think in, in, in himself, I think he would agree sometimes he gets complacent. That's my role as a manager to try and get the best out of him and really push him to go on to what I think he could be. And he's an exceptional talent. Can he push on further? Possibly. But it's up to him to prove it. Yeah. In the second half, uh, Brock and Hurst have obviously come out at us and, and, yeah. and, and understandably tried to get back into the game. But we never really seemed in too much danger of conceding. Is that just down to solid defensive management and, uh, and I guess for the whole team as well, not just at the back? Yeah, we were in trouble. You know, when I walked through the door, there's no, no, no two ways about it. We're in a relegation fight and we had to simplify things. And our shape tonight was, was outstanding is what we've been working on. Mike made two really good saves and that's really important for him. He's had a difficult time since I've walked through the door. Um, so again, I'm really proud for him and happy for him that he's been able to pull off two wonderful saves. Um, and look, both teams had chances. That's, that's football, that's, that's inevitable, but um, we are doing the fundamentals and basics right, and that's what gives you chances to win games at this level. And with Greg scoring again, I've got to mention Bezo, though. He's, he's, he scored that goal and it looked like it meant an awful lot to him. He's come running up to the yeah. dugout. Um, he, he's been immense as well, hasn't he? Yeah. Since He's not been mentioned much, but fair play to him. He's been outstanding since he's come back in. He doesn't need the armband. He does it through grit, determination and heart. And that, that guy is has been immense for me and I'm so proud that he's part of what I want to build and, and he'll be part of next season and we'll get him fitter, stronger and he'll be part of the coaching team next season as well and, and it just great, adds a great depth to what we're doing and yeah, you know, all the lads, Greg, again, scoring again, it's just, it's a fantastic feel and they're, they're, they're on, you know, cloud nine and they're really enjoying themselves. And it's another win at home yep. and another game unbeaten at home as well. It, the home form for any manager, you must, any manager would be absolutely delighted with that form and it's just, I guess it's testament to the lads and to the supporters and everybody around to keep that going as well. Yeah, look, we highlighted games at home when we walked through the door. And like I said, we this club was in trouble. We talked about it again just a minute ago. This club was was, was sliding and, and it looked like it was going to be a big, big fight. But um, the home form has just transformed what we've done. And, and on Saturday, we got our first away victory. So we, we try again on Saturday to get a second in a row away from home. And <clears throat> we go again just with absolute confidence. And... I'd also like to credit the lads that come in today. We had two drop out really late this afternoon and um, Cleves and, and young Toby got called up and they took it and, and, and fair play to them because that's the kind of attitude we want within this club. Yeah, and just for, that leads me on really nicely. I mentioned it last week, for the, well, sorry, for the last home game, how important everybody in the squad's going to be. And it's been proven, hasn't it? Because these four wins don't just happen with 11 players, do they? Oh, absolutely. And, and they're pushing them. You know, in training, we, we, we're, we're getting, you know, 18, 19 players. They're pushing each other. And that's really important. And now from the end of the season, you know, the lads like Lance and Hayden and Cleves, so they'll get some chances. They'll get some minutes. And, and it will be without pressure, which is nice for them because and there's nothing worse than feeling you know, like you have to perform under pressure. So um, it's exciting from now to the end of the season, but we want to continue and, and keep up that good form and that momentum. And just finally from me, you just mentioned there, it's US Portsmouth on yeah. Saturday. Uh, another big game, yeah. another important game. Um, I guess we just go into it with confidence, but as you always say, just implementing them. Um, fundamentals and getting yeah. things right going into what will be a difficult game. Yeah, I think we go into training and we 
forget what's happened today. Um, we train right, we recover right, um, and we go we go for another win on Saturday. Kyle, congratulations. Thank you. Thanks, Josh.